If you're an orchestrator or you work in music preparation, probably it would be nice to have access to menu items that normally require a couple clicks. So, for instance, showing bar rests and having the ability to toggle that back and forth on and off. So I'm gonna use my button I've made for this Abelius package, and there it goes. Press it again, and there they go. Rests disappeared. So now I'm gonna do the same thing with bar numbers. It's a little bit more difficult to access this one. It's under view, and if you hit Control in Sibelius, you can see it shows you the key tips. It'll tell you exactly how to get to that menu or that field. But if you put that on a macro, you can toggle that stuff so much faster. So we'll try the button here. Went to Invisibles, it showed the bar numbers. Pressed it again, and now there they go. This time, I want to show you what I can do with filters. So Sibelius has the means of grabbing specific notes within chords, so whether it's the top or the bottom or the second or the third note. And I'll reiterate, you can get there pressing control and then following the key tip uh, letter cues for quick nav, but I'm just going to use a button. So let's grab these top ones. Got the top notes in the chords. Okay, that worked as expected. I'll reselect the measure and try for the bottom. And that performed also as expected. And for the record, each of these buttons that I'm pressing, the functions activating those filters, it probably took maybe like a minute to program each of these, if, if that. And I'm happy to show you how to do that. Another functionality I wanted to build in is just accessing the advanced filter. So you can do that with a button press. Um, you can just get to the normal filters, which I'll show you with another button press. These things are fine on their own, but I think they'll be really handy if you want to bundle them into maybe a series of commands where you're accessing a menu and toggling some other things. So for instance, I'll use this long macro demo. We'll take a look at what I've got in there. Yeah, so it's going to resize some things. It's going to click through a couple fields on pop-up menus and only in Sibelius um, faster than I can do on my own. This way I don't have to think about it. So if there's a font you like to use or margin resizes you want to try, you can quickly resize score and parts. You can toggle multiple settings in seconds, right? They're all just going to cascade one after another. So if you're an orchestrator or you work in music preparation, just know that Soundflow really excels at getting those harder to reach menus and being able to stack multiple commands on top of each other. This first release is not going to be comprehensive, but hey, if you're an orchestrator or you work in music preparation and have an idea for a macro that can really make your life better, your workflow faster, feel free to reach out to me on my website or drop me a line on Facebook and I'll see if I can incorporate it into the next build.